Well, how do that? Jumps time back inside of No Man's Sky. And I'm going to be doing my bit against the Vile Brood yet again. So we can go and root out Corrupted Sentinels, to be honest. Or we could hack a Sentinel Pillar. We'll go there. Call of the Void. Let's go get these, I guess. And we're off to take out Corrupted Sentinels, of all things. Let's go do this, I guess. Awesome. Let's head on in. Yeah, I want, I want to get in my ship. Yeah, ta, thank you very much. Let's go get him. Zoom! And we're off, I guess. So yeah, you may have noticed I'm in VR. Yeah, using my Oculus 3, or whatever you want to call it, Meta 3, Quest 3. Company is changing names all the time. Freaking awesome inside of this ship, it really is. Anyway, okay. Pow, pow. Where's the low, where's the marker then? Okay, so it's taken me to a system covered in markers. Fun times. And I'm not seeing. Dissonant energy spike detected. Reach the planet. Omwag. Okay, well, that's not planet Omwag. You planet Omwag? No. How about you? Are you planet Omwag? Yes. There we go. We're going there then. Wrong button. And we're on our way. Zoom. Heck yes. Looks like we've locked onto some sort of corrupted base. Right, well, let's head on down to this then. Apex and corrupted sentinels. Oh, so there's an apex cre creature on this planet too, is there? Pretty darn lovely. Looks like we've got a convenient landing pad right here as well. Let's see if we can land on it then. Okay. Oh, I can see a bug creature already there. I'm coming in for a landing. Let's uh, pull up. There we go. Oh, this is actually a really cool planet. There's just bugs running around just willy-nilly all over the place. And then there's these just majestically hovering. Hello, planet. It is I, the Steve. Right, okay. Dissonance reactors. We've got to find these dissonant reactors then. Let's um, scan the area. There's one over this way, apparently, people. 419 U's that way. Let's go get it. Oh, see, it's just over there on the horizon. Let's go. Up chow. We leap. Oh, look at these plants. They look freaking ace, don't they? Okay, sorry, people. Um, I'm just... Still stunned by the magnificence of VR. Take that, you. Yes. Can I just reload? I can't remember how you do the reload. Or, like, you know, actually just doing it. Seriously? No ammo in my inventory. Well, that was lucky, wasn't it? Inventory. Let's, uh, let's get crafting something, shall we? Yeah, I want to make a load of that. That'd do me. Now reload. Ha ha! That'll teach you, I guess. Let's head this way then. Oh, looks like there's some sort of creature following me. How'd you like that? Eat lead! I guess. I love these flying triffid plants in the sky. Very cool. How far now? We're there. We're pretty much there, people. Well, I say we're there. We're not. Let's just over this hill over here. Watch out, there's another cat creature there. I see you. Yeah. Evil little felines. Right out. Now, I don't know how this looks for you guys out there in the viewerverse. For me, it's looking rather snazzy. Right, there we go. Let's take him on. Dang it! Reload, reload, reload! Get out of it! Spider tank! Ah! How dare you! How very dare you! You want some? Get some! Okay, right. We've got another one apparently this way. 500 U's this way. Out of it! Chicka pow pow! 
Let's leg it there, people. Let's get there as quick as possible. Giant spider creature over there. Beasley creature, whatever you want to call it. Looks pretty darn freaking lovely, doesn't it? I don't know how people with arachnophobia feel about giant beetle creatures. I mean, I haven't got it, so I wouldn't really know. Okay, that, that went a little bit dodgy there, didn't it? You know what? I might... I might go into here, options, go into the old graphic settings. You know what? Down here, I've got this on at the moment. I'm just going to turn that anti-aliasing off, okay? So, no more anti-aliasing. Inside of the Nexus, it was proving me a little bit of a problem, but you know what? Down here, that's probably made things a heck of a lot sharper for everyone, hasn't it? We'll leave it like that for a bit. Now watch this back and see which I prefer. Well, where did that... where did it go? Oh, it's there. 300 users. Wait, let's go get it. This feels a lot different in VR. It really does. Oh, yeah. Run like the freaking wind. Can you shoot them? Oh, you can. All right. I didn't know I could do that. That's pretty cool. Hello. Wild life of this lovely wild planet. I guess. Now, I've had a few people saying, I've got this on PlayStation VR 2, and it actually looks better on PlayStation VR 2 than it does on the Oculus Quest. Now, considering that on console, all your graphic settings are dialed in, you don't have to worry about something being slightly off-kilter, you're probably right. Wow! You get back! But what I would say is on um, the Oculus, you're getting a lot more reflections. And I actually feel that it's sharper than when I used to play it on my PlayStation VR. I mean, I'm no VR expert, but this on the Oculus feels great. And before on the old um, PSVR, when I used to rotate to the right, it used to lose frames. And it used to make me feel rather queasy. This one doesn't do that, but what I would say is this hasn't got phobaic rendering. So it's trying to render everything at once, and every now and again you get, like, blurry smudges is the only way that I can I can sort of put it. It's like all the grass here looks great, yeah? The grass just over there looks a bit smudgy to me. Does it look smudgy to you? I'll have to watch this back and look and see if it looks smudgy. It looks great when you get to it, but from a distance it looks smudgy. It's not really a technical term, I suppose. It's smudgy. Oh, for fuck's sake, I want to scan my freaking environment. I don't want to fire all my paralyzed mortars. All right. Come on. Oh, I was pressing the wrong button. Okay, well, I just wasted all my freaking bullets. Okay, there's one over here. There we go. Let's go. And I could do it reloading those bullets now. Um... Yeah, I just want to reload. Yeah, can I... Um, I, I want to reload that. Okay, we've got plasma launchers. That'll do. We've got eight of them. All right, let's go then. Is there another cat creature? There is. Take that. He's on fire. He'll die slowly in agonising death. That's what you get for messing with the Steve! Yeah, right. Oh, look, there's like a dragony type creature up there. That looks freaking majestic, doesn't it? Heck yes, it does. Okay, well, I think this might be the last one that we've got to get. And um, we've only got to go another 400 U's. Oh, I can see it from here. Can I shoot it from here? No. Heck no. Okay, here we go. Is there another cat creature following me? There is. Take that, cat creature. Right, here we go. Meow. This is quite a wondrously beautiful planet, to be honest. Quite like it. Like it a lot. I guess. Nearly done my daily quota for today. I mean, I've only killed three of these sentinels. I've killed a couple of corrupted sentinels, but it's not quite the mission I thought it was going to be. I thought I'd be taking out a lot more sentinels, but let's do. And my liquidating will be done for the day. Yeah. We'll take out a few of these little crab tanks. Just for fun. Take that. Hop-cha! 
Yeah, you want some as well, do you? I can oblige. Yeah! Zappity doo da, zappity day! What was that? Aha! Rascal! Roused about! There you go, you wretched little herb. Die. Do you want some? I just like them apples. Ah! Pull a flamethrower on me, will you? Up chow! Oi! Fire! 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 Oh, okay, great. It just changed to combat scope for no reason. Boom! Yeah! Zap! Pow, pow! Oh, you get back! We're in a gravity storm now, people. Okay, right. Quick menu. Call my ship. That one. Right there. Great, we can't. Might as well take out the rest of these then. Might as well get liquidated properly. Have it! Boom! This gravity storm is seriously cool in VR. Take that, all of you. Can't really see what I'm shooting. You're done. Ha-ha! Shot that in the sky, that was fun. Oh, this is epically awesome! Who's next? Oi! What the fudge got me there? I can hear bullets, but I can't see what's shooting me. It must be invisible. No, this is trippy. Okay. Shall I just take a slow walk back to my ship? I think I shall. Right, where is my ship? The ship? This way. We're going this way then. Let's go. Ah, oh, this gravity storm is freaking something else, people. Look at all the plants all swaying and everything. It looks bloody awesome. I guess. Very awesome. I mean, there's a big purple ball over there. Look at that flying up through the atmosphere. Whoa, yeah! Heck yeah! This is cool in the gravity storm. Whee! Heck yes! I can fly! Love it! Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, hello. You doing a favour? Yeah, I'm doing a recording right now, Hedgehog. <laughs> How are you? I'm not good. Why? What's wrong? I was about to get a soul in the bag. Yeah? There is jumping frog inside the bag. There's a jumping frog. I'll come and sort that out. I like frogs. Oh. I'll come and have a look in a minute. I'll just complete this mission. <laughs> just leave him where he is. I'll come and help you in a moment. Oh, sure. Uh-oh. The storm is clearing, which means I'm going to be falling. Oh, look. There's rocks freaking floating in this gravity storm. I've never seen that happen before. Seriously? Oh, that is so weird. Okay, anyway, let's um, let's get back to the ship. We're going to head back to the Nexus. And then you may have heard there, Ivy just uh, came into the room. She's come across a frog in distress. So I'm going to have to help out a distressed frog. Which, um, you know, you, if you know me long enough, you know I used to have pet dart frogs. Uh, I really do like my amphibian friends. And reptilians, and any sort of strange creature, to be honest. Ah! Dang it! Okay. Let's try that again. There we go. Let me in. Ah, wrong button. I just shot my ship. Oh, this headset's on very tight. Right. It's like going swimming with the goggles on, you know, that where they press into your face, and you don't know where the goggles start and your skin ends. All right, there we go. That's on. 
Wait a minute. I put them on a little bit too hard. Right, here we go. We'll get out into the atmosphere. I'm calling the old Nexus once I'm clear of the planet's atmosphere, which it should be about now. Boom. Yes, please. Get rid of that. And we're going on in. Sweet. Lovely jubbly. Yes, my Crichton armor. Now, I am getting more used to the controls in VR. I'm getting better at it. I'm, I'm probably nearing the point where I'd say I'd be confident to start a new playthrough in VR. If that's something you'd like to see me do, let me know. And hopefully when Welds 2 drops, I might think about doing that. It depends what they do with these cloud saves, doesn't it? There you go, got myself some Quicksilver, Quicksilver, heck yeah, lovely jubbly. And we've done our bit against the Scourge, we're now at 53% and we're on phase four. This is going far quicker than I thought it ever would. There we go, we made our save. So there you go people in the viewerverse, that is I for today. Till next time people, thank you for watching, if you haven't already subscribed, please do! Heck yes, cheery bye, goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. Um...